Yes, good afternoon. Today, we're going to talk about a new model here in 2010, our Apocalypse Trifecta. We're very proud of the Apocalypse Trifecta because it's the first time in our history that we've ever done a model with interchangeable bezels. And it took quite a bit of engineering to achieve. And we did it with our most popular model from our most popular series, our Apocalypse series in our Epiphany collection. Now, your timepiece is going to come packaged with two extra bezels. It comes in three colors, either blue, red, or green, and today we're going to focus on the blue one. That's what I've brought here to show you. But you're going to get, no matter which color you order, you will get an extra carbon fiber bezel, and it's got a nice lacquer finish. The watch will have the color-coordinated Duracoche finished bezel, which in this case is the blue bezel in the center. And then over here, you're going to have the brushed stainless steel bezel with the black Sterling S screw heads. So we're going to now focus on how to change those bezels to achieve three different looks with one watch, the Apocalypse Trifecta. So now this is the blue. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to push down on it and give it just a little quarter turn and then it'll come right off. Now to understand how this works take a look here right here at 9 and then again over here at 3 and if you take a look on the inside of all three bezels you'll notice there is a couple of notches right across the the bezel from each other right there and then right over here. Those are the notches you're going to want to line up at 3 and 9. So now let's put this brushed stainless steel bezel on to give you a completely different look. First you want to want to know where your notches are so that you can kind of line them up and then once they're on you want to give it just a little kind of quarter turn right like that and it's going to click into place now if you turn it past that click you can force it past the click and we've had calls on that why doesn't my screw line up because you forced it past the click so you don't want to force it it will click in right there where it lines up and it's on nice and solid but you do you see how it gives the watch a completely different personality now okay and now if you really want to sport it up, let's go to the carbon fiber uh, finish on the bezel. So again, you're going to want to now push down and just give it a little quarter turn. And let me grab that and take it off. And let's put the carbon fiber. And again, before you go to put it on, just take a glance at where your notches are. Line it up. There it is. Once it's on, then just give it a little slight push down and, a, and just a little quarter turn or even an eighth of a turn, and it'll click into place. And there's your carbon fiber look right there. Now, uh, one thing I want to point out, in fact, I think what I'm going to do is I'll take the watch off my wrist, okay? I've just taken the watch off my wrist, and we've had people call in and say, well, um, uh, I, for me, when I try to turn the bezel, it's slippery. It's, I'm not getting a good grip because maybe your skin is you know, not as rough as my skin or it's really not a strength issue. But you'll notice the sides of all the bezels I have a high polish finish. So it is slippery. And if you are having difficulty in any way in turning the bezel, here's a little trick for you. If you have a piece of saran wrap in the house, any kind of little piece of plastic, if you just lay the plastic over and then use that like a, to grab, it makes it a little easier to just take the bezels on and off. Putting the, the bezel on is really, you know, you, you won't need to, to do anything for that. But, and again, most people have no problem as far as, you know, putting it on. Once you have it lined up, you can just, you know, push down and turn. It's easy to get it on. But to get it off, some people say that, they, that it's very slippery for them you know, some of the ladies, whoever, whatever. You know, one little trick is to take a little piece of saran wrap, just lay it over, or a plastic from one of the watches maybe that you own that wrap, and just use it to kind of grip, and it makes it very easy. 
Well, that's it for the Apocalypse Trifecta with the interchangeable bezels. Uh, I certainly hope that this little instructional video has helped you in uh, being better able to use the interchangeable bezels and really enjoy the different looks that you can achieve with your Apocalypse Trifecta.